We're building a journal from scraps, clutter and free ephemera. Hello and welcome to The Treasured Page. I'm Melanie and this is our quiet crafting space. We've been looking at making a house. This was constructed out of one sheet of photocopy paper, one side of a greeting card, some embellishments from a book and some ink and some paint techniques. And then inside it's lined with a tea or coffee stained paper. So that's how it appears and how it will go in a journal. This is this month's project, making a house, is to come and sit inside here, although this one won't be. This is going to be sent off to the lovely Shirley who lives in Aberdeen in Scotland. So this is going off there. So that is my house project. I am going to put a little bit of decoration in here. So I said the inside could have some collage, but I think I'm just going to keep it to the corners and leave this as writing space. Um, so we'll have a look at that. I've come up with some ideas. Thank you, Linda, for the brilliant suggestion of terracotta pots. Absolutely. This is a little Mediterranean house and it wouldn't be right to not have a few terracotta pots. So I think that's what I will do in there. That's a really great suggestion. I love that. Thank you, everybody, for your comments and all of your good wishes. OK, if you've been following along with the Build Journal, then you will know that we have a project every month to help us create a journal and the journal will be used for next year 2024 and we are putting it together at the moment we're only using things that we find things that we're given maybe free ephemera on our travels or if you have a friend that you are likely to be able to swap with they can send you things so the first project was this lovely pocket we looked at the policy closure we looked at how to decorate it with napkin and embellished it with an insert here this is absolutely cool I think this is great I might even put some writing paper on that and even tether it in uh, so that's an idea and then that will all close you won't see the inside because that's all going to stick down and be sewn in eventually very, very brilliant. So if you haven't seen that video, you need to go and check that out because that's how to make one of those. And then it, it will be sewn in, bound in here. It'll hide the binding. Very clever. Then we've got this, which is the fold out. So it, it could be a tri or it could be a quad fold out. We've got three here. So it's a, a like an accordion style tri fold out or flip out. This one has the wonderful butterflies all across it and writing space on the back. So that was brilliant. That's from Joanna. I really loved receiving that. And so that was the second. Then the third project is the page uh, wraps. And I have just received my parcel. So we're going to have a look at that. And the fourth one is the house. So that brings us up to speed. And then in July, we'll have the next month's project. So if you are all caught up up to date, then you will have made your house already and you will be putting it into your journal. Now, I've put some pieces in here, but I am not quite happy with the layout. So I shall probably jiggle things about because I don't like this page with this page. So I'm going to be moving things around. I was given this tag and I was given some French script, so I've got an idea to do a page there or maybe on the back. And then this will be my signature here. So the idea with the house is that it can either become one of the front inserts that you see there and then that leads you into the summer or it can come further back into the journal. Uh, maybe it's just a page and it slots in there and that's all lovely. Um, so that that could even go like that. But this is not staying with me. This is going to be sent on to, to Aberdeen. So the challenge that I've set myself is I'm only allowed to make a journal out of things that have been sent to me by my swap partners, which has come about over on Facebook. So I'm just opening this lovely parcel which I've received. This is my next parcel. It's come from Birmingham, so it... Oh, look, I think it is from Jeanette. Let's have a look at this. OK, look at this beautiful stamp here with this sweeping effect here where she's put some paint and this colour. It's absolutely 
brilliant. I'd love to take that and use that. So this is a really good, nice board. In fact, this could become part of the cover of the journal, so I am definitely going to keep that. So I've got to keep everything. I'm keeping everything that I receive in this box. It's building up. These are all the little pieces that I've collected. I need a better system, really, so that I can find everything. But that's not going to fit, so we're going to have to come up with another idea. These are all the extra things that I can pull from and play with. And in here, this was my signature keeper that was sent to me for, from Shirley, and now, I, and now she's getting the house. Um, extra papers. These are going to be my autumn and winter papers for the signature there. So... That's all coming together. Let's put that to one side and see what I've got here. And then I really need to go through some of it because it is building up now and it looks like a very generous parcel. So let's have a quick look. Oh, this isn't that pretty straight away. I hope that you were well and really enjoyed making this swap. I hope you like it. I've enclosed some goodies for you. Take care, my lovely love from Jeanette. Thank you, Jeanette. Hey, and look at this. So I have to keep everything. So this is musical note washi tape. It's actually quite sticky. That's great. Where can I... So I'm going to stick that on there so that I can use that. It's really limiting here because I'm not allowed to use any of my own supplies. I've just got to use what's being sent. So even this tissue paper, which is good because it's pink and I was looking for something pink. It's a nice scrunch, isn't it? Oh, look at this. Okay, here we go. Buttons from the charity shop. Well, I'm excited already. Buttons from the charity shop. Oh, it's going to be a button journal because I've been given two buttons already. Oh, look at the trim. Oh, my goodness. Oh, this. <laughs> oh, where did you find those? Oh, they are super. Can I put these in a journal? Can I cut them up? Or shall I wear them? They're for wearing, aren't they? Look at those. Where did you find those? Oh my goodness, they are brilliant. Look, treasured page socks. Oh wow, that's awesome. Oh, love that, I absolutely love that. You have captured my imagination there. <laughs> These are brilliant, oh, I'm so excited. Oh, I love goodies. Do you know what, it's my birthday on Saturday. That's really well timed, thank you. Oh, how lovely. That's so lovely. Oh, my goodness. OK, right. Where, Where's the things? Here we are. This is what we're looking for. And then we can go through the extras, which appears to be extensive. Oh, wow. Wow, look at that. So we've got a butterfly button. And look, there we go. So that's going to go over the page. We've got this lovely lace trim little bit of this boho fabric which looks like it's been dyed that's really fun and that's on the back okay that's that one you've sent me three. Oh, look at this isn't that beautiful that's so lovely I love it when you get these different colors that you're not expecting and this lovely rich clarity color there with the lace that's just that's just different isn't it and then these lovely butterflies that's really simple. That would be a lovely simple page though on that side. So that's really nice, isn't it, to have those. You know, that doesn't take up too much bulk. So that comes over and and that one's a bit longer. Okay, that they're fabulous. And then this one. Oh, look at this. I love that. That's a really cool effect on the sewing. Got it upside down. <laughs> also links in with the same fabric. Really interesting zigzag. You've gone crazy with your sewing machine. I love that. And then that's room for me to write or embellish. Isn't that fun? Whew, let's have a little sip of fruit juice. Oh, it's a hot one today, so trying to stay hydrated. So I've ended up with three page wraps. Okay, so to use in this journal, I have got this envelope and it's full with wonderful little pieces and bits and bobs. Look at this. Let's have a look. So we've got these little tickety things. 
um, which are obviously quite useful. They're great when they're sewn around. I like that. Josephine goes travelling. <laughs> okay, and then these are vellum with botanicals on. So it's good to try and show how to use these because if you end up with one of those booklets, they go on forever. You just, you know, there's so much, isn't there? So we'll have to come up with some ideas on how to use them. Well, they look quite good, all scattered about there, actually. Tickets, lovely, and then some labels. Okay, brilliant. That's all super useful. Book page, great. Excellent. Excellent. I don't think I've got any book page, so that's great. This has come out of a book. Oh, look. Oh, wow. Oh, okay, because I really quite like the idea of doing a nature journal. So this is lovely. That definitely supports that idea. Oh, look, isn't that pretty inside as well? So we've got the trim. Lovely, useful twine there. Great for tags. Piece of lace. Okay, this is a lace that goes round. But if we cut away that, we can take away the gather and it can become a straight piece of lace again. So that could be really great to play with. And this is so pretty. Oh my goodness, look at this. I love it when... Oh, look at this. Uh, that's really pretty. Really, really pretty. How useful. Okay, and then another bit of, another bit of wide lace. Oh, okay, great. And trim. Oh, fabric. That's interesting. I love that. That's nice. Gauze type fabric. Okay, my mind is going here with some ideas. This is nice. Look at that. Isn't that great? What are these? Oh, wow. Are these tea bags? Little bags. Look at that. That's brilliant. I wonder if this is for putting herbs in, you know, for cooking. Maybe you make a sort of like a herb bag and then it infuses. I'm not sure. I've never seen those before. You'll have to tell me what they are and where they come um, from. So we can think of something for those and have a play. Play with things that you've never seen before. It's really exciting. I've got this lovely blue string that's great navy blue string who knew all right so i've been given these amazing napkins look at them we've got lots of butterflies going on here i mean you can't go wrong can you with me and butterflies so that's fine they are great so that's a lovely interesting music paper i think we could probably hinge that in and make a page out of that because that's really fun to use oh there's loads oh wow oh wow oh my goodness me okay that is absolutely fabulous it's so great i'm so grateful i've got enough here for several journals jeanette this is amazing thank you so much there's a pack of papers coming out to you actually because you're a supporter of um of the Kofi page so um, that's coming out to you shortly so I haven't forgotten it's just I've been poorly and then Britain to colour oh look at this this is good oh wow oh this is fun oh wow this is so f oh look at this is already done oh love that look at that instant pages i love this so it's already colored in you can use that page you can pull that out lovely lily pads across the water how beautiful is that that's kent is it i've never been i need to go there it's beautiful i'd like a picnic there wouldn't you gosh i could eat a sandwich and look at that amazing where's this that's a bit further afield for me the west highlands so that's scotland but how stunning is that and then we've got this viaduct in Yorkshire. Beautiful. Never been there either. I've got places to go, people. I've been here. That is the Stonehenge in Wiltshire. Yes, I've actually been really close to those stones. That's really fun. Quite a magical place. And then we've got the Orkney Islands. Again, Scotland. Oh, oh this is really cool. 
This is really lovely. What a brilliant thing to have been given. Um, and then we've got whales. Look at that with a fish. What a brilliant. That would look so good. That would look so good as a page, wouldn't it? Oh, wow. And then with the geese. Look on the farm, because we had a bit of a farm feel. There was a poem, wasn't there? I might do that. Brilliant. Okay. What else have we got? Look at this. Oh, look at this. It's like my barge holiday I'm going on. That's in Warwickshire. I'm not going to Warwickshire. I'm going to Wales. Oh, cool. Oh, that's really inspirational. I'm going to take that page and have that in my... Um, I'll ha oh, well, I'll have to make... I'll have to use this for my barge holiday journal <laughs> oh that is brilliant so that is edinburgh maybe yes edinburgh castle been there that's cool oh well, there you go we had a little whistle stop tour around britain thank you so much jeanette that's lovely that's the same image front and back so we could even use we could even do something and use that get rid of that Oh, well, wow. I haven't even looked in here yet, so this is buttons from the charity shop. Oh, I've ripped my bag. Never mind. We can always repair things like that. Let's have a look. Let's just stick that down. That'll become part of it. Buttons from the charity <laughs> Oh, wow. Oh, look at these. All right. Well, I'm in my happy place here, aren't they? The gold ones. And we've got the leather ones. All the metallics. Let's see. These are fun, aren't they? That's nice. Purple matches my watch. Bright pink, hot pink, red. Beautiful vintage. Oh, look at that. Look at that one. These are so good. Oh, and that's where you've got the butterfly. So we've got a matching one there. More of these. These are the fabrics. Fabric ones. The metallics. That's fun. We could have that dangling off of something. Um, that one's... That one's um, crying out to be covered, isn't it? And then... What's this? Lovely wooden one. And a shell. Um, wow, loads. There's lots of little shirt buttons here. Right, okay, so that's awesome. Really brilliant parcel to receive. I am so blown away. That is absolutely tremendous. Okay, so now I can see them, so that's going to be easier for me. So I'm going to be kept busy for the next month, that's for sure, with all of this. Um, it's extensive, it's way too much. <laughs> Thank you very much. We'll put it in there. There's nothing like um, having, you know, that's lovely. That's a lovely selection there. It's a really good choice, especially when you don't know what to send people, what they have, what they don't have. And I always think that other people's goodies are more interesting than my own. And I know that that's the same vice versa. But uh, yeah, let's, so let's add these to the journal. That's a good page. That might want to be there. Maybe. That would work. That's lovely, isn't it? I like that. If it was sticking out there on that pink page. That's really... F oh, I like that as a belly band. Oh, my goodness. That's great. The yellow tones work on this one. That's nice. And then I think I shall save that one to go further into the journal because I've given, been given three here. Okay, let's get these glued on. I'm adding some stronger glue here because this is sort of thicker cardstock and I just want to make sure that it will come and live in here nice and neatly. Okay, so let's have a look at how these work out. So I'm putting this one in. And I'm just making sure that I've got that all covered. All right, so let's add that in. Right, a big slick of glue there and down it goes. So this is my page wrap going in. I'm going to trim the bottom because it's a little bit long for the paper that I've got here, but that is fine. So let's turn it that Put way. This away. Is 
that's embellished that page so far there. It gives me space to do other things and I might want to embellish it in the future. We've got to remember that this is going to be a journal for next year so we will be able to add things. We'll be adding our own ephemera and our own spin on things to the journals. We just need to create the basics and then being helped by these ideas to just give some intrigue to a junk journal. Just these interactive tactics tile pieces being added into the journal just this lovely feel of that those textures is really great that crinkly paper that really lovely metallic button and just this is soft soft cotton in a dyed fabric it's just really really nice it's just that that loose that sort of comfortable that homely feel that cottage sort of extra bits and I, just, I love that and then this paper is just no I haven't done this I've just assembled it I'm just assembling things and it's really really brilliant it's a really nice way to honour friendship I'm definitely having that there on this avocado dyed paper okay because I've been given three of these I am going to detach this portion I love that and I will use that elsewhere in the journal I could have glued it down and that be a thicker piece but I don't think it needs it because the paper is reasonably thick so I am going to detach it and use that elsewhere so I'm just going to cut this bit away here just cut away Okay, I'm detaching that piece because it's just going to work really nicely and then this is super, this is great. Look, I can then use that piece as something in the journal. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch me as we embark on this journey of putting together a treasured page book using things that we find, things that we're given, things that we have had from our past and putting it all together in one book to make us feel comfort and joy and look back on it next year with admiration for our own creativity. So thank you so much for watching The Treasured Page. If you'd like to see more of the videos, all of the playlist for Build a Journal can be found here on YouTube. You'll be able to see how to make the signature keeper. You can have a look at all the projects coming up and if you click the bell icon, you won't miss future videos. And as I get my strength back and start putting together more video content for the treasured page, I will be very pleased to spend more time with you. In the meantime, put your feet up and enjoy some of my other videos found here on the treasured page for which the library is extensive. Take care and I'll be with you very soon. And above everything else, just remember to slow down and make crafting time for you. Bye bye now.